in the first video, we simply recorded a voice recording, just some audio, and now we're going to listen to it and then edit, edit the audio briefly. So my playhead is at the beginning of my audio, and as I move it, you can see it moves along the top and as well as the bottom. And to start and stop it, I simply use the space bar. Let's click the space bar. And you can see that the this is an introduction audio moves. Video to GarageBand. And we will now, if we wanted to edit that audio, let's say down here at the beginning, I don't need this empty open space. So what I would do, I've clicked on the audio up here at the top, and I'm going to split that track. You can go up to Edit and Split, but I always use Command-T. Okay, So I have it just where I want it. I've selected it. See, here is when it's deselected. When it is selected, you notice that's dark. I have it right where I want it, and you can see at the bottom too, I'm not cutting any audio off. And I'm going to click some Command and T on my keypad. And now I have two clips. As you look at the clips, you can tell that there are two clips there because you can see this, this little indentation. So I have one clip, I have two clips. Now we wanted to get rid of clip number one because that was this audio down here that we didn't necessarily want or it was just dead space. So now that it's highlighted, I just click the delete key and it's gone. Now I can push this audio over to the beginning. Which I'll do. Let's push that over. Now I can continue to listen. Action video to GarageBand. Notice I have a couple places in here where there are other spaces or gaps when I wasn't talking. So if I wanted to split the clip right there, I have it highlighted, I would hit Command T to, to break it there. And then here, I'm, I'm pressing the space bar, or I can just drag my playhead. Here's the end of my silence. So I have the beginning of my silence right here, and here's the end of the silence. You can tell because there aren't any audio indications there, any audio waves. So that's the end of it. So I'd Command T again. Command T. Oh, you know why I didn't do that? Actually, that was a really good mistake. I was clicking Command T, but this one, this audio portion was highlighted, and I had my playhead here. So if I wanted to actually split this, I have to select that piece of audio. I'm glad I did that. You have to select the piece of audio, then Command-T, and now you'll notice it's split. So what I have highlighted here is the, the dead space. You can see it down here at the bottom as well. Talking, dead space, more talking. So if I want to get rid of this dead space, I've split it. It is now separate. I can click delete and then what I do is I click on this and I push it over and now I don't have all that dead space. Video to GarageBand. Pretty handy.